Justin Bieber is held up at customs at LAX for nearly four hours. Are his legal issues to blame? But first, X-Men director Brian Singer is breaking his silence and lashing out at the man behind the teen sex abuse allegations. Singer issued his first statement since being accused of sexually assaulting a teen boy at a Hollywood party and in Hawaii in the late 90s. The director denies the claims made by the alleged victim, Michael Egan. He says the facts will show this to be the sick, twisted shakedown it is. I do not want these fictitious claims to divert any attention from X-Men Days of Future Past. Singer goes on to say that he won't be taking part in any upcoming media events for the film, which is out May 23rd. Egan, who is now 31 is suing the director along with Broadway producer Gary Goddard, TV producer Garth Ansier, and former Disney TV president David Newman. He claims they were part of a Hollywood sex ring that victimized teenage boys. Make a way real quick, guys. Make a pass. Make a pass. Justin Bieber was met by a mob of photographers last night as he left LAX. He was held up by customs officers for nearly four hours after returning from Japan. There were reports he was questioned about his legal issues issues, which include a DUI arrest in Miami, the egging incident in California, and the assault charges in Toronto. Bieber was eventually allowed to enter the country. His lawyer says it's normal for the Biebs to be put through secondary questioning. I came in like a Miley Cyrus is out of the hospital and on the mend. The singer has reportedly been discharged after being stuck on bed rest in Missouri for over a week. Cyrus was hospitalized for a severe allergic reaction to antibiotics and forced to scrap her remaining U.S. tour dates. But now she's preparing to hit the road for the European leg of her bangers tour, which kicks off May 2nd in Amsterdam. So glad that Miley's feeling better. Seth Meyers is making the switch from late night to prime time for one night only as the host of the 66th Annual Emmy Awards. 66th Annual Emmy Awards. And now, here he is, Seth Meyers! The comedian will serve as MC for TV's biggest night on August 25th. This will be Meyers' first time hosting the award show, but he's no stranger to the Emmys, previously winning a trophy for his work on Saturday Night Live. <laughs> Children of the 80s rejoice. The cast of the big screen remake of Gem and the Holograms has been revealed. Nashville's Aubrey Peoples will star as the pink-haired rocker in her first major film role. She posted these behind-the-scenes pics to Instagram. Gem's bandmates will be played by Stephanie Scott from Disney's Ant Farm, the Fosters, Haley Kiyoko, and Pretty Little Liars' Aurora Perrineau. They're all featured on the first official poster for the movie. No release date has been set. Are you excited for the big screen version of Jem, or are you like me and just found out what Jem was today? <laughs> and how do you think Seth Meyers is going to do at the Emmys? All you have to do is tweet us at NCity.